before you watch this video, I just wanted to give a quick disclaimer. I was halfway into editing this video when I realized that it was going to be quite long. It's also rather boring compared to my normal stuff and very personal. So, if that doesn't interest you, just wait around to my next upload. It'll be a good one. I know that line is pretty dreadful, but I'm currently just packing everything. Packing my whole room, packing my whole house. And look what I found. Isn't it just the cutest thing ever? Not one. Not two. But three. Skill ties. It's Thursday the 22nd of December right now. And we're heading out to bring the first batch of our stuff. Motor cars are packed. It's also Central's last day of school. The car really is packed, I wasn't even joking. It's mad. Filling her up. Walk you through the whole house because it's big. Well, whoa, I'm only Gee. Very nice. Oh, this is like a study. Very like it. I love the floor. There's two beds and mattress. Okay, front door. Oh, it looks like a child's room. Sandra can have that. This is a pink room. It's alright. I don't mind it. Whoa. Stay in the room. It's a lot bigger than our one. I'll say that. And demo switches. That's lovely. This is a sun room. Just finished vacuum cleaning the whole house. First things first. Why did someone have so many hangers? Look at all of these. Right, so this is only half the stuff. There's about like seven bags. There's those things. right now and we're finished for now we're hopefully going to pack some more stuff and come back later in the afternoon but I'm not 100% sure look at it so great so much better we're collecting Sandra from school we've arrived for the second time today in Toher just after turning 4 p.m. and it's still getting dark so we kind of want to get out before it's fully dark. Unpacking. Not about that 21 pious life. It's not about 5 seconds of summer yo. It's half 7 and today has been a successful first day. It's Friday the 23rd of December. Second day of the move. It's one of Christmas. Oh my god. Today, as you can probably see, we've ordered a van that's going to be collecting all our things like the beds, the couches, the big cabinets.
things that we cannot fit in a car. That's coming in an hour, I think. So yeah, it's gonna be an eventful day. Waiting for the van man. That van is not gonna fit everything that we have. For mine, <laughs> it's well big enough. Very fancy. Third trip down to Topher and the second day. We have a van following us and I'll we'll see you in a few. It was just over and done within two hours and we have all our stuff in here. I'll show you around. Two beds, a bike, sofa, then we come to all the furniture. Mainly IKEA, but you know, what else could you expect? All of this fit in one truck. Great. Now, what next? The windows are closed, as you can see right there. This is a joke. That short snippet, this house is, may not be that nice, but yeah. So the closed bank wouldn't close, I mean, so the closed bank wouldn't open and I left all closed by right outside it. Is that good to eat or bad? Third day of moving and a fifth trip down to tow her. Bit of progress. Here's how my room is looking. There is a new desk right there. The bed is going to go there. One of my wardrobes. And then clothes rack. Pretty nice. Not sure what to do with this piece though. Oh yeah, one more thing. All my shoes. <laughs> Small update. Bedroom's looking fresh. My room is still an absolute mess, but what can you do? We finally sent him his bedroom, which is... Yeah. Whoa. I didn't record too much today, but essentially it's Christmas Eve, so I'm going home. Christmas Day 2016, we're going to church. The dental on. Potem już trzeba będzie się co raz rzadziej paliło, bo wiesz, i no. wygląda tak, że niki tak rozruszane, że one będą moment ciepłe. Cicho. That's a lovely mass. I think it's day five of the move. Our seven trip down there, and look at the car. It's just packed to the brim. Same with the other car. I'll show you the inside now. Oh, would you look at that? A tractor. 
arrived home and the kitty has settled down. Look how cute he is. Everybody's unpacking. The house is still an absolute mess, but it's only been a few days, maybe a week. We lost our kitty. It's so cute, it's so brave. Come on home. An apple tree made that too. I'm just gonna run around here and see what else is here. Um, I'm not sure what this is, but it's plastic. Wow! Now this is some view. Oh my god. So, that's Toher Church right there. This is a field. And, um, somehow, I'm kind of in a bush. Yeah, my room is a tad of a mess. Tunage. It's lit. I, I was not sponsored for this video. We're finished for today. I haven't vlogged much this morning at all, but it is day five of the move and our seventh trip with two cars to tow her. I keep you subdued. Tactic isn't the word where I should bring a bin. <laughs> Lol. Camps of lighting a candle. You saw I can handle my amazingness. I think this works. I haven't really touched up. Whoa, my face is red. So I really haven't touched up on the whole moving situation, but it's about a week since we started moving in, and we still have no heat. Yeah. So that means we can't really sleep here, or we can't spend any of the afternoons here doing the house, cleaning up. Hopefully, the landlord will try and get a fix, but as of now, no update. As you can see here, there is like cold air. It's freezing. Not too nice. Hi. So yeah, this is my last day in this house. My last full day. And yes, if you're asking me, I am sleeping on the floor. Although I only really just woke up. I'm going to try and do a small story time. Five years ago, when we started renting this house. It was all going great, or so we thought. The house is relatively nice, it has a garden, pets are allowed, and it's quite close to the town. We are very satisfied. But as the years passed, problems started to emerge. And these were big problems. This is my bedroom. It came with just one cabinet. And that was it. And to add to that, the window 
Now it closes, so there's a constant breeze coming in. It's pretty cold, I'm not gonna lie. Bedroom, which only had one bedside table and a bed, nothing else. Pretty bad, right? To add to that, the radiator doesn't work, so you had to buy a little small electric heater just to be able to stay the night. Now, the bottom is alright, but it's a bathroom. And if you have a look at this room, it was bare as this. I think you're starting to get a small picture of this whole house. It was a disaster. Enough, the main lobby had zero lights, zero bulbs, and every appliance had to plug it off. But it did allow cats. This was not even serviced once in the past five years. The center room had no TV. One couch and no table. It's ridiculous when you think about the amount of stuff that we had to buy. Unfortunately, the dishwasher doesn't work though. Yeah, the radiators don't work. So I hope a fast whole picture of the house was gotten. I know I sound half dead, but that's what I am right now. And the main reason we're moving is because the landlord doubled the house price. And yeah, it's not worth it for what's in here and what little she does. So yeah, that's that. I'm finally moving house after five years. And the worst part is the new house is not even ready. Like I showed you some of the clips and yeah, there's no heating, no electricity in the half house and I, I don't even know. We couldn't really bring the fish with us in the car. So, Adrian's going to have a little new pet fish. Merry late Christmas, Adrian. Woo. It's our first troll. Hi. Adrian's going to have a little nice friend with him. It's going to be great. We went to the police to try and get the house fixed, to try and get the landlord to do anything. But no, the police couldn't help and I don't know what we can do now. The heating does not work and there's a big gas leak so we could probably die in a matter of a day or two so it's very dangerous. The landlord is on holiday and doesn't want to get repaired. He told us to just give it back the keys on next Tuesday and he wouldn't even return the deposit. I don't, I don't know what to do. Like, what are you doing? You cannot fit in there. <laughs> we can't find our kitty. 30th, 2016, on our last trip to Toker. 10 carry journeys with two carrots.